Do you think you know most people in our church? Do you think there's more to church life, but you don't quite know what it is, or it just seems that little bit out of reach? I wonder, have you thought about joining us in September for our forthcoming parish weekend? If not, I want to ask the question, why not? Because for me, this is a really amazing opportunity to get to know other members of the church family, to have real time to make connections and friendships that we don't normally have, to have time to go deeper in conversation, to have time just to hang out together, and also to have plenty of fun along the way. It was a wonderful opportunity to get to know everybody from our church. Um, Sunday seems so short, sometimes we don't get time to say much more than a hello to each other. We thought the weekend away was really great. We'd had a really, really busy week at work, so we were a bit worried about being too tired. But it was just a really great chance to just sit and spend some time with friends and relax and chill out. Uh, do some worshipping, eat some really great food and spend some time learning about God. The aim of the weekend is a simple one really and it's about bringing us together as one church family so that we can come together with God right at the centre of everything we do. And Cloverley Hall in Shropshire where we go is a great place for this. It's got everything we could need, it's got fantastic food, comfy rooms, plenty of space, amazing grounds, tennis courts, swimming pool, games rooms, and did I mention also great food. The grounds were absolutely gorgeous, so much space, the children had so much freedom. The food was absolutely delicious, I felt we were looked after all weekend. Um, I think there was two courses at every meal and it was just so lovely to be served up every meal time. When we first got there on the Friday night it was really funny because people were arriving at, at different times because uh, some people had come earlier, some people had come late after work, um, but there were lots of cakes and nice cups of tea and drinks for the kids and then the fun games to play there were like um, pictures to identify from people when they were younger uh, there was a quiz to do with who'd done the most interesting thing in their history and there were some really interesting ones there um, and it was just great to get to know people properly those people who perhaps you've met quite a few times and you can't quite remember the name it was okay because actually you'd get to know them even better and get past that embarrassing oh I can't remember your name stage so that was really good um, obviously we ate together, but we also got to socialise together as well. It was lovely and peaceful there, as well as there being so many different activities. There was a lovely little prayer room laid out where you could go if you so wished. The children were looked after so well too. Um, they had their own groups to go to, which meant together as adults, uh, we could worship together, have time together, um, or just have our own time. I know my children absolutely loved their groups um, and remember fondly the different things they made, a prayer book, a special mug, um, and playing parachute games and all different games outside in the sunshine. On the Saturday afternoon we got to spend some free time together and it was brilliant because it was such a glorious weekend. The weather was beautiful, the sun was shining and we got to spend time jumping in and out of the swimming pool or the kids would just run around in the, in the lovely grounds. Uh, there was a climbing frame. It was just lovely and everyone was really happy and smiley and, and laughing and I've got lots of happy memories of that afternoon. On the Saturday night we had great fun um, where we had a talent show, inverted commas. Um, I think most of it was really watching Ian or laughing at him maybe, but a few more of us were persuaded to take part, which we did and it was great fun. Beautiful noise coming up from the street. You, you were lucky to have a room. We used to live in a corridor. Oh, we used to dream of living in a corridor. Quite a lot of people got involved, uh, and even the people who didn't stand up at the front were enjoying watching it. Um, the Hughes family did uh, an excellent dance, uh, there was a bit of drama. Yeah, one coach. Use your imagination. 
imagination. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it was absolutely wonderful, so uh, we're already planning our act for next time. Something I really enjoyed on the weekend away was the chance to worship somewhere new with people. Um, you get quite used to worshipping in the same place at church every week. Um, so it can be quite exciting to worship somewhere new and, and in different ways as well. So we used to sing at the start of the teaching sessions and at the end too. Um, but we also had a late night worship session, which, which was a bit different. Um, an extended time, a chance for people um, to just spend time with God as well as each other. Our sessions with Bishop Cyril were so interesting and he delivered his message in such an, an entertaining way that I think I could have sat and listened to him all day. Um, he was great fun to be around and got to know us all so well um, during that weekend as well. The weekend takes place from Friday the 15th to Sunday the 17th of September this year, 2017, and you can find more details on our website. It costs £110 per adult, which is full board, and did I mention that includes great food as well, especially the puddings, which I love. To book your place, do speak to Ian or Rubina Crow, or simply fill in a form. The deadline for bookings is the end of the summer term, so that's July. Don't forget, as a church, we're committed to making it as easy as possible for everyone to attend this weekend. And so with that in mind, the church and the PCC are happy to pay for all children 16 years and under. The whole weekend was amazing for all of us. Um, in my family, I know we all had a wonderful time. Um, and as a church family, um, anybody I know thoroughly enjoyed it. Um, I think it brought us all much closer together um, as a church family, as a community, and coming back into church uh, the next week, there was just a different feeling of uh, more togetherness, a closeness, and there has been ever since. Um, so if you are thinking of coming, I would advise you to come. Um, it really is a fabulous weekend and you won't regret it. If you only come to one church event this year, do make the parish weekend a priority. You won't be disappointed.